to another segment of the Wacky Jack Show with your host, Wacky Jack. Daddy, why does everything always have to be about you? Because it's the Wacky Jack Show. <laughs> Today's show is the baseball show! But first, a word from our sponsor. How to spank baseball. Brush back. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for Baseball Oddities. Bob Feller was a 20-year-old pitching phenom for the Cleveland Indians in 1939. His reputation was for the fastest fastball in baseball. With archaic timing equipment, he was clocked at over 100 miles per hour. Today, using radar guns, that would come close to 108 miles per hour. Bob had his mother and family come 250 miles from his hometown of Van Meter, Iowa, to see him pitch on May 14th, 1939, Mother's Day. Bob was in rare form that day, pitching a shutout into the fourth, when Chicago third baseman Marv Owen was late on a Bob Feller fastball and fouled the pitch into the stands. The ball struck Mrs. Feller flush in the face. Bob finished the inning as his mother was taken out on a stretcher. The Sox touched Bob for three runs that inning as Bob's concentration was broken. He went on to finish and win the game 9-4 to four amid reports Mom would be okay. Mrs. Speller spent two days in the hospital nursing a bruised face and two black eyes, but no further ill effects. Bob went on that year to strike out a record number, 246 batters, finishing with a 24-9 and nine record. But what are the odds in a crowd of that size your mother would spend such an unforgettable Mother's Day. Baseball Oddities. And here's where we beg for your money. Our goal is to reach $5 so we can keep this show on the air for another five months. For your PayPal donation of only $2 to ja 4 vid at Hotmail.com, we will send you this wonderful medical magnetic therapy transducer. Just place it on your mouth to absorb all ionic magnetic pain. See all the magnetic properties it has? See how it works? It feels so good. When used like this, it's guaranteed to cure snoring.